Greetings and salutations. Welcome back to this Let's Play of E4. I'm Keb. I'm Barry. Are you sure about that? I am now. Okay, then. You know why I'm sure now? No. Well, there we go, then. So there. Let's see. Ah, we need new generals. They all decide to die. You know, my, I just had a large group of my generals leave the game. Not pleased with it. I'm content with that guy, and you can lead this stack. That's going to be okay. Woot! The French Ben and War ended. I got 0.5 prestige from it. However, will you survive? Well, 0.5 more prestige. Just told you that. Uh, let's see. Incorporate the Knigets into the country. Volt and Ostmarch. After declaring war, I tried to remember, did I upgrade all my forts? <laughs> Not not the general order of that I deal with those questions in, but works. Uh huh. At least the Bruneian forts are finally falling, but I've got tired of waiting, so I started a war with China. Can't leave you alone for a minute. Oh, did I do something bad again? No, no, just off their waging war, destroying hopes and dreams and families. Not my fault they won't just give me all the land. Well, maybe if you gave oh. all your land to me, then they would be more receptive. Oh, you're trying to chase me down, aren't you, Ming? Fine, I'll get away. Let's see. Let's go here. Ports, stand down. All of you. Siege of Palu is over. Siege of Palu! The Siege of Palu. Siege of Palu. Do I have an Inquisitor? I don't. Yeah, you know what? There we go. Oh, that's right. It's time to reevaluate forts. Well, let's see.
That's fine, that's... That, those are fine. Fine there. Your problem. So let's see, Ming, where did your army go? And so far, my puppet is doing more damage than I am. unusual I'm just seeding uh, just attrishing away at forts you know, all the new territory I grabbed I'm realigning my forts Holy moly. Dang it, can you like actually go to the proper province? There we go, finally. Uh. It's quite nice. A nice little war this. Be a shame if you broke something. Who the heck are you? The good thing about Hawaii is that they're keeping the entire Chinese army busy. Well, I mean, the, they, the boys need the exercise, so it's good, it's good for everyone. So it's me just fine. Mm-hmm. I'm just going to attrition up a few hundred thousand men away. So... At his, uh, ports. Bella Zero, the Austrian province I totally forget about all the time, is currently <laughs> occupied by English West Indies. <laughs> no, they have a natural interest in that province, obviously. Scotland is largely occupied by England. 
English Louisiana is overrun by New Scotland. Uh, Oh, China finally decided to go and attack me. Aww. Aww. Poor kitties. This could get ugly. For them. I don't know. <sighs> they had a uh, terrain and crossing advantage, but uh, yeah, they're dying. Good. I'm slightly worried. Fight me up there. Could I like move there, please? There we go. What if I don't want to move there? Have you thought Stupid about dummies. my feelings? How I feel about this? Oh, good lord. Problem? I don't think I could ever do that. Consider your feelings. Actually, fair enough. I have more than enough with my own. The feels, the feels. On the bright side, China doesn't have... Actually, they do have coastal areas. I've completely forgot about their Ming East Siberia. How can you forget about a vacation destination of that caliber? I'm uh, much more inclined to deal with the local area, so to speak. And I don't know... Did he make a level 8 fort somewhere up? Yes, of course he did. So I guess I'll have to go up there. Uh, maybe. Must make more money. I make more money than the next six countries combined. Must make more money. I'm very glad that both England, Castile, and Portugal are all pulling the trade in the proper direction. Done Malacca. Don't know why the heck they would do that. They would all probably stand to gain by pulling it towards Zanzibar and out rather than up through India. Yeah, you've got 33,000 in the treasury. Although, most people have a huge amount of treasury. I guess I'm just... I'm special. Eight fifty one. Yeah, you have... Your income is greater than the next four countries combined. Almost five. Greater than France, Castile, myself, and Scotland. So yes, you obviously, need, make you obviously need more money. Yes. Keep telling you. Just because you keep telling me doesn't mean I'm going to listen. Ah, uh, fair enough. Uh, is there a province nearby that actually has a decent supply limit? Of course not. Oh, well, fine. 
So, Ming, where are you going this time? You're actually trying to seal down that fortune wall. Have fun. There we go. I've now caught my ass. <laughs> it is mine. It is my core. The core of my being. There, me. As long as you don't bother my sieging, I'm, I'm a, a okay with that. I mean, at this point, we might as well carpet seed a bit. Oh, and send my fleet up to your shores, just in case you have a boat or two. Eighty thousand Chinese under a ruthless general. That sounds less like a game and more like alternate history. History a little too close to home. I think we're going to go up and visit that guy. Actually, you tag along. Right now, please. Just finished converting Kismayo. The first I secured my ass, and now I want to kiss my O. Okay. And there's always room for making this conversation even stranger, by the way. Well, you're involved, so that's just kind of a given. Look, I gained more territory. <laughs> Plenty of 14 forts that I don't need. Uh, what's my... Well, there's your problem with the fiscals, <laughs> at the very least. Here's that region. And basically, they put a, a level eight fort in every single province I gave them. Which is funny because they were all in provinces adjacent to a level 8 fort that I had, so there was no real reason to fortify like that. 
Who was this? The knights. The, ah. the knights who say icky 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 or however that routine goes. Okay. Forgive me, it's been a long time since I've seen Monty Python and the Holy Grail. Uh-huh. Let's see, you're actually moving to Lancho. What the hell was that? That was a stomach growl. Really? I'm gonna ask you why you have a moose in your apartment. Uh, that was because the deer got tired of staying here. Oh dear. And I needed a moose's head. Okay, and it came with uh, with attachments. Yeah, this is getting greedy. French got ashore in England. What? Oh! Oh, you decided to arrive piecemeal, didn't you? Yes, of course you did. Oh, great. Uh. Problem? No, I was trying to intercept a Chinese army and they decided, let's attack one at a time so that we all stack wipe each, each and every one of us. Oh, that's always fun. So, yeah. Ouch. Don't that work. Nice. I completely forgot to check. I, oh, of course, though. I think it was my boomstick army that went first. That explain it. Oh, nothing but an artillery. Oh yeah. <laughs> well, that ends badly. Oh yeah. That must have been. Yeah, that must have been what happened. We're going to attack over there. Send in the troops. But sir, the the artillery first. Send in the troops. But the artillery. The, send in the troops. Why did we lose? We sent in the troops. Send in the clown. Wait, no, that's... That's a different outcome. Nothing to do with pinatas. I'm, I, am yada, gonna, yada. I am gonna take a bat to something hollow and whack it loose till I get some candy, but that's not nothing to do with pinatas. So Ming, you know that level eight forge. That's going to be gone. Yeah, the soon-to-be export. Where are your level 8 forts, by the way? Uh, fort map. Fort map, where are you? I know you're here somewhere.
51 check, Ding. Hi, Bob. What the Pope do this time? Nothing. He's actually been behaving himself. Potsdam is like incredibly unhappy. Good to know. And it's that time again. Oh. Darn it, I, run, it really? I run a tight schedule, darn it. Well, boo. Okay, I guess we will take a short break and be back shortly. Alright, folks, thanks for watching.